Former President Donald Trump's social media company Trump Media and Technology Group is in serious financial trouble. The company's stock has taken a nosedive, wiping out a large portion of Trump's net worth. Here's a quick look at what happened. Last week, shares of Trump Media dropped to their lowest point since the company went public this spring. Despite a 7% rebound on Monday, the stock has lost 72% of its value since reaching a peak of 66.22 US dollars on the 27th of March. This sharp decline has significantly impacted investors, including Trump himself. His 114.75 million shares were valued at $6.2 billion on the 9th of May. Now they are worth only 2.1 billion US dollars. This drop has knocked off Trump, the Bloomberg Billionaires Index of the world's 500 richest people. Experts have long warned that Trump Media's multi billion dollar valuation isn't realistic. The company is losing money, bringing in little revenue, and Truth Social remains a small player in the social media world. Another factor driving the stock's decline could be the upcoming presidential election. Some analysts believe that the fact that Kamala Harris is polling neck and neck with Trump is contributing to the stock's fall. Since Joe Biden endorsed Harris on the 21st of July, Trump media has lost about half of its market value. While the company struggles, Trump Media is trying to grow. Last quarter, it made just US$837,000 in revenue, but launched a streaming platform called Truth Plus, available on iOS, Android and web versions of Truth Social. Another concern is the upcoming expiration of the locker period on the 20th of September. This will allow Trump and other insiders to sell their shares. However, experts say it will be challenging for Trump to sell a large number of shares without further damaging the stock. There is hope that the stock could recover, especially with Trump's upcoming debate against Harris on Tuesday.